News Channel 5 exclusive, a local tech company has big plans for the RNC. It's working to turn Cleveland into a smart city just in time for 50,000 visitors this July. Megan Hickey spoke exclusively with the developers and joins us now live from downtown with more. So, Megan, what is this technology and how does it all work? Well, it's an app on your smartphone that interacts with your surroundings, allowing visitors to the RNC to get real-time updates on events, things that are happening, and history of Cleveland. Just a walk down East 4th Street. Oh, already getting an update. And the information comes pouring in. Looks like they're highlighting an event that they're a part of on the 23rd. About half of these businesses have Bluetooth beacons provided by InTouch, a Cleveland-based tech company. They just <laughs> emit a signal up to about 70 meters. And users who download the app can get information and updates as they stroll by. By giving small businesses or surroundings the ability to tap into these beacons and upload certain pieces of content, um, we allow those beacons then to broadcast information right to people's phones. 80 businesses like Society Lounge here on East 4th already use the beacons to send out notifications. Deal specials for doing a special for the day just to kind of reach out to people that are kind of just brushing past your place. And now the city is partnering with InTouch to more than double the number of beacons by the RNC. Well, by having these 50,000 delegates and guests coming in, uh, they have no idea what's going on around the city at any given moment, where they're standing at a certain point, what's going on around them. Bernat said the city wants to show off to its guests. Anything that's relevant to that moment in time. And remind residents of what the Cleveland area has to offer. We want to show what Cleveland really can bring to the table because we have so much to offer in this great city. Now, InTouch tells me that the goal is to have 200 beacons in place by the RNC and then, of course, to develop that technology after the convention leaves town. Live in Cleveland, Megan Hickey, News Channel 5.